okay, you started out really young. Did you, you start out performing in malls first? Well, so my sister and I, we were a part of this dance group called Fancy Prancy Dancers. <laughs> I know. Um, my parents, they were in the, they were in the army, uh -huh. and on base, they were having auditions for this dance group. And my sister and I were like, okay, yeah, let's go ahead and, you know, try out. We ended up getting in the group, and we would perform in malls. We would perform at some of the army conventions. And I still, like, remember some of the dance moves. Do you? Salt and Pepper, they had the, the song, uh, 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 uh. Uh, uh, See, uh, I could uh, be in the group. Uh, 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 uh. So anyway, it was fun. It was fun. I feel like that's <laughs> how I got rid of my like stage fright. Is it how you got... practice? So you started dancing first. First, and a lot of people don't know that. Yeah. See, I missed that part because I got the voices, but I ain't know the fancy yeah. fancy move. Well, you know, I do a lot of dancing on TikTok and all that kind of stuff. <laughs> don't actually ask for a dance move now. Oh, oh yes, and okay. you know, um, in Texas, there were just a lot of pageants. Are there anybody from Texas in the in the crowd? I'm sure. Okay. See, I know so there, there's like a lot of pageants, and uh, my kind of talent was. Oh, there's my sister and I. Um, my talent was dancing, and so I did um, Michael Jackson's Moonwalker, and I had the the outfit and everything, and I learned how to moonwalk. Can you still moonwalk? <laughs> you you, you I, set yourself up. Oh, here's the, okay. I, I like to have a lot of fun, <laughs> especially with Instagram and TikTok and all that. You look like you were having a lot of fun. Yeah. So you guys grew up, like, how old were you when you all first started? You know what I mean? Um, in the industry? Yeah. Uh, oh my gosh, I would say we were probably like 12 years old. Yeah. 12 years old. 12. So we what was it like going out that young? It was, you know, it was it was interesting, and, and I have this funny story where, you know, my sister and I, we had just came out on, you know, Sister Sister. Um, we were in New York, and we used to have to have a bodyguard, and um, we just wanted to feel normal, you know, like normal kids, and we ended up going to the most normal place in New York City, which was Times Square. And I remember, <laughs> I don't know if it was like a busload of kids, but they just started running after my sister and I. And the only place that we could find like refuge was in a pharmacy. And so, I don't know, we, it, it felt like we were like the Beatles, you know, back then. <laughs> yeah, just, uh, you are. Yeah, but <sighs> it, it, was, it was fun, you know? I would have definitely been one of those kids trying to track y'all down. <laughs> just know that. Aww. Such a fan, You're so sweet. happy to be here. So how yeah. old are your kids now? Um, uh, uh, my son, he's 11, mm -hmm. and my daughter, she's four. Okay, I have yeah. to ask you this. Aw, thank you. <laughs> when your son was younger, I, I used to hear a lot that our sons looked a lot alike. Did you ever hear that? You know what? I do remember <laughs> that, and they're close in age, yes, you know? Yes, Munch is, well, DOJ, let me be clear, because mommy don't call me Munch. Okay. Um, DOJ is okay. now, he's 13. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah, because three's 11, so yeah. yeah. Okay, and my, my son, I don't know if your son's into the same things, mm -hmm. but... My son, he loves Pokemon, uh, anime, and I'm like, I don't know what's going on. With See, the, I can't follow all of that. Like Pikachu, it's like, I feel like they're speaking like a different language and basketball. There we go, basketball. We gotta get them together for some basketball. Yes. What do you like at the basketball games? Oh gosh, um, I feel like I have a lot of anxiety. I, I don't know, like, cause- It can my, give my, you anxiety. It, it can, my son, he just had a game yesterday and I'm not the parent that's like screaming, yeah, go, go, go. I am. You? Girl, I be almost uh, out there on that court. Okay, see, <laughs> that's not me, that, Dude, that's, really? that's Cree's dad, Corey, okay. he's, he's that way. I'm so nervous, like even when he shoots, as he's shooting, I will look away. Cause I'm, I'm worried if he's like gonna, you know, miss the shot or, yeah, but so, that's, yeah. Oh, goodness. <laughs> well, maybe we could balance each other out. Out, yes. Because it does get stressful. Yeah. Them games it get does. real intense. Yeah. Okay, we got to get them together. I would love okay, that. I would love For them that to play. Yeah. And then your daughter, oh. I mean, she has quite the personality. That girl, she is. <laughs> <laughs> Even the way you, that girl. She, look at her, look at her face. Oh, like, wow. She, she's just, 
She's full of personality. I love that she is an individual. She will say what's on her mind. I was doing my um, YouTube channel show called Tia Mori's Quick Fix, and I was like, Cairo, um, what is your favorite show? I wanted her to say Tia Mori's Quick Fix, but she, I was like, okay, Cairo, what is your favorite show? She was like, SpongeBob. Like, she doesn't <laughs> care. She's like, I'm gonna say what's on my mind. You cannot that. influence me to do anything. <laughs> I am gonna do me. Here, I'm telling her to smile, and look what she's doing. <laughs> She's like, Mama, I don't know about that. Like, nah, I'm good. <laughs> if you like this video, smash that like button and subscribe to the Jennifer Hudson Show YouTube channel. Check your local listings or visit JenniferHudsonShow.com to see when you can watch four episodes in your area. And don't forget to sign up for the newsletter.